What's going on, everybody? Don't be alarmed. It is me. I had a shaving mishap in which I had to shave all my face show hair off. I feel pretty weird. I'm not gonna lie. This feels weird. I look weird. Like, what the hell? I'll get over it and then it'll grow back, but whew, this is rough. Some people might be like, oh, that's okay. Mm. Mm -mm. It's rough. Either I shaved it or it was the Charlie Chapman. And Charlie Chapman is also, he also has another person, counterpart, in which not so famous, you know what I'm saying? Kind of didn't want to have that look um, going on, you know? <sighs> At any rate, we're going to move on from that. And that's not going to be the focal point of this shindig. Anyway, Blind Guardian, we're back. And today, I bring about Wheels of Time. The Wheels of Time? I think it's the, oh, it's just Wheel of Time. Why the hell did I say wheels? All right. Now, I read in the comments that uh, this song is like uh, somewhat affiliated with uh, the popular show Game of Thrones. So, yeah, never watched the show. Interesting enough, I seen on Twitter today that they only have like 67 days until the final season so it's going to be over so that means if I ever do decide to watch it I have a lot to watch at any rate um we're just gonna get right into this hope everyone's doing good today and stop staring at my face I'm just <laughs> I know it looks weird I know I know it feels naked Whatever. Let's just get right into this.
time, I will never give up. The inner war, I can hold against it. My mind, my mind, my mind's in darkness. The young man says, I will never give in. The prophecies. Feels so weird doing that now. Um, that was good. It I liked it because it had this cool Arabian, Arabian um type of vibe to it. But not only that, but the vocals were on point. And excuse me if I say this wrong, Hansi or Hans Hansai. I think that's the vo- the vocalist, the main vocalist. <sighs> For me, one of the best Blind Guardian songs I heard. Not saying it was the best, but one of the best. Like, I like that. And the song itself was... I mean, it speaks volumes. Obviously, I don't understand everything. But if I had to give my first impressions on what I thought... I mean, it's just the, the awe-inspiring thought that comes to mind when you think about time. And one of the lyrics that spoke out to me was, there's no beginning. Oh, wait. Well, it was basically like, no, there's no end, no beginning. And think about that. It doesn't make sense. You know, and it said, and um, one of the other lyrics, you burnt me, now guide me. For me, it's like, I was born, so now I'm here. Hey, take me along through the journey. I, I, I could be way off base. I'm just giving my personal opinion why I felt about it, because I had to go over it again and, and really analyze it some more. But that's that. That was a good song. I really, I really appreciate you all for for recommending that that. Um, not this song. I'm not sure if anybody recommended this song, but the band in general, Blind Guardian, like, whew, it's deep. It's deep. And I just, I just think about where the hell have I been? You know, I was so 
growing up, I was so entranced with mostly hip hop, but then like mainstream rock, like more or less like, you know, you got uh, Blink-182, you got, and then maybe they're like pop, really. Um, you got Disturbed, you got Evanescence, you got Linkin Park, you got the Foo Fighters, you got, uh, I listened a little bit Slipknot, uh, Sether, um, I could, I could name a lot, but it was most or less mainstream, and I didn't know, I, I'm so happy that I'm, I'm learning, like, about this stuff now. <sighs> excellent, excellent. I'm not gonna hold you all. Because I know my face is like weird to look at. It's weird to me out. So I'm going to get off of here. And um, <laughs> we'll see you on the next video. Alright. I hope y'all enjoyed it. See you later.